hey, my name's Andrew. You're in my basement, and it's not creepy. It's a cornucopia of fun. A cornucopia well, of fun. Cornucopia of fun. A cornucopia of fun. Cornucopia. We have a great echo in my basement. This is, of course, another issue of issues in Andrew's basement, where we talk about stuff that matters to me. I have three very special guests today. One is my new best friend from Lordstown, Lordstown, Ohio. Please welcome Angela. Angela. Then, of course, my second guest who had, was precocious enough to grab a thing before me. I'm precocious. Say your name. Welcome to Issues with Andrew. Hi, I'm Catherine. I'm from Forestville, New York. Of course you are. And my final guest, my favorite guest is? I'm Sharon. I'm Sharon, and I'm from Auburn, me. All right. Except Maine. So what's on my mind today? How are my panelists doing? Are you comfortable in those beanbag chairs? Yeah. yeah. Of course you are. Fantastic. First thing that's on my mind, Argyle, how's it work? Let me know your opinion, Lordstown, Ohio. Well, I say with Argyle, one sock at a time. Holla! Holla! Holla, indeed. <laughs> well, you need to understand that I like building dollhouses and the mini furniture that goes with them. So Ooh. Argyle is really nice because it's easy to match up the patterns. <laughs> little sweaters for little guys. They are tiny, like your voice. And finally, my favorite guest. I don't want to pick favorites, but I have. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> Argyle. Oh, well, I'm going to answer in bird whistling because that's my hobby. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I strongly disagree. I, I, I find, I find the cardinal. opinion controversial, but I am swayed. It was cardinal. Oh, now we're on to our favorite final part of the show where I bring out my stepbrother. Come on out here, jerk. <laughs> so many steps. What's up, stepbrother? Not much. I'm here for the weekend. Uh, my stepbrother, Marcus, has a question for you guys. Go ahead, Marcus, you jerk. <laughs> I do. I wasn't really thinking about my question beforehand. Uh, it's a good thing you wrote it down. It was about, uh, it was... Well, actually, I got a, a piece of viewer mail. Oh. So I thought I'd read one of those questions, if that's all right. It's from, it's from Greg in... Pflugerville, Texas. He's a level place. one, and his hobbies are shot glass collecting, and he drinks coffee with happy thoughts. So here's my question. What <laughs> would be the best possible way of combining shot glasses and happy thoughts in the morning time? Yeah. Oh, man, Marcus always asks a better question. Let's hear from my favorite up first. It's me. Uh, and I know that question was directed to me because um, I like to drink coffee with Irish liqueur, like Bailey's on my birthday. So I would just say whatever shot glass you use, fill it up with something Irish first. Ah, oh, there's a reason she's my favorite. Um, I think shot glasses are particularly nice in dollhouses because they look gigantic. Uh. So it looks like someone's drinking an enormously large coffee. Consistently inconsistent. Well, I just like to say I don't understand the question at all, but my name is Angela from Lordstown, Ohio, and coffee makes me think of jail because while on the inside, coffee is more valuable than gold. This concludes another episode of Andrew's Basement. We'll see you next time, Marcus. Jerk. Hey. Hey.